Phoenix Estate Aden I don't know how to pronounce Aden Aden If you really want to make money from this project, you need to subscribe and hear my views. Let's go. Wait, 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 wait. How to pronounce the name? Is it Aden? Aden? Or Aberden? Because another project also got Den. It's called Jaden or Jaden. So what is it? Uh, let's call it Aden. Ah. Aden. Ah. Aden. The Aden by Qingjian. 105 units 2027 Ah yeah, small project Previously, it was Phoenix Road Apartments And they have 36 units And for on block to take place Developer need to build at least 2 times more than the 36 units in order to make money So from 36 to 105 units Developer can build 2.9 times more for this project Bought 42.6 million The per square feet per plot ratio Super cheap ah Much like an EC price 630 per square feet only Hey, Altura land price already 662 per square feet This one private property only 630 per square feet le. so are they going to sell at EC price because Altura selling 1004 ma. so will this be 1004 15% profit they can sell and make money at 1300 plus per square feet if they were to sell their average price at 1008 per square feet developer giant huakui and they will make 60% profit developer can be very savvy developer buy low doesn't mean they will sell low ma. so the most important question here will you as the buyer make money from buying into this project this is the location for Arden it's 7 minutes walk to Bukit Panjang MRT station 550 meters quite fast la. I walk 5-6 minutes you may take 10 minutes la, because your leg very short like Mr. Bom Bom ma. Mm. Oh, hello everyone. My name is Bum Bum. Cute boy. Now let's look at the site plan. I still cannot find. Where's my tennis court? Okay. I want tennis court. Uh, this is a side plan, nothing much one uh. One swimming pool, the rest all grass Small project, very fast one uh. Let's talk about unit mix People usually buy a 2 bidder for investment Consists of about 42.9% The rest, 3 and 4 bidder consists of 57.1% Now let's look at their smallest layout Which is their 2 bed 1 bar Ayyo, I hate it 657 square feet Starting from 1.148 million My average 1.2 million Works out to be 1,826 per square feet Next a better layout of 2 bed 2 bath 721 square feet from 1.323 million my average 1.38 million 1914 per square feet next a bigger layout something that you can stay 3 bed 2 bath 1012 square feet this one you can walk hey but this one special you have a storeroom ah. 1.688 million my average 1.75 million 1730 per square feet 3 bed 2 bath plus study 1109 square feet you have a storeroom over here you can walk hey Starting from 1.858 million, my average 1.95 million, 1758 per square feet. Last two layout, four bidders, four bed, three bath, 1206 square feet. Starting from 2.108 million, my average 2.25 million, 1865 per square feet. Finally, we have the four bed, three bath plus study, 1389 square feet. Starting from 2.38 million, average 2.5 million, average about 1800 per square feet. I found a resale condo which can be a good comparison or alternative. Hill Star complete in 2016 which is just beside the Arden. Let's look at their performance. Hillstar 216, 396 units. Not a very good comparison because this is 3 times bigger. And since it's 3 times bigger, the resale transaction should be healthy. Ayo, like that only ah. Ayo, one beta, two beta, one beta, one beta, one beta. Like that is very investment based already ah. And they only sell 1,003 plus per square feet. And if you buy the other at 1,009 per square feet for their two beta, that's $600 per square feet difference eh. Most importantly, owners of Hillstar, are you a Huawei or not? Huat Huat la, 88 profitable transactions. Wow, they only make 100,000, 150, lose money la. 100, 100, 100, only one make 330. The rest, wow, lao eh, got 1,001 la. 
Walao e chuye. They sold at 1003 right now, they only make like that. Eh. Never mind. Let's look at whether are there losses. 52 unprofitable transactions. Walao e lose 3, 4 MacBook Pro. Walao lose money, lose money, lose money. Wow, this one your father kick you out. Wow, chui, chui, chui. Wow, chui la. So now what you have learned? If you want to make new friends, Hello, my name is Hua Kui. May I know where you stay? Oh, I stay in Houston. Nice to meet you. Then you reply. Okay, bye bye. Then you walk off. Ha 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 ha. It's just a joke la. Don't be sensitive. One more good comparison. The most recently launched called The Miss, which I also done a review recently. The Miss is located over here. And they only sold 27% on launch day. They sold 110 out of 408 units. Even CDL has a challenge to sell in this area. Let's summarize. Let's talk about good things. Ah. Let me think. You can walk to your MRT station. Not bad. That's one. I can only think of many not good things. Ah. But because I like MRT station. So my location will be a 6. Launch pricing. I see that many people make this mistake. Which is a deadly one. You always compare with big projects like, hey, the me selling 2000, eh, this one only 1006. Eh. This is totally wrong because small project is always cheaper per square feet. Bigger ones are higher. Bigger projects tend to move faster in terms of price and appreciation. Smaller project, ah, yo, chui la. Chui la. So if the miss is selling at 2000 per square feet, this one should be definitely lower a lot. What? And let's say the developer is going to sell this average price at 1008 per square feet, my launch pricing will be. Three. As it strategy, your neighbor, more than three times of your size, only got a few people transacting in that six months. Imagine yours is one third the size. Maybe six months are only sell one unit. Oh. It's a small project, no facilities. People buy here may not make money because your neighbor don't make money. And your neighbor sell at 1003, you are going to buy at 1008. Can you sell at 2002? Don't talk about 2002. Can you sell at 2000? Can you make just 200 per square feet or not? Wow, very difficult. Eh. And for that, my exit strategy, two. Over service score, 3.7 stars. Now let's have some fun. What is the estimated sold on launch day? I guess 15% and my wife 20%. To get ready, you can contact this number 8606-0670. However, we are very busy. For those people who want to know more about this project, you can contact your own agent. Guys, before you buy any property, you can do a lot of due diligence and do some uh, research on your own. So if you don't feel anything good, then you can give it a miss. If you think this is good, you can go ahead. And for those people who is going ahead, let me hope that you will be a giant Hua Kui in three years so that everyone of us will be even bigger. If you really want to be Hua Kui, subscribe right now and I'll see you in my next video.